hi this is Monique welcome to my channel on this channel I do reviews and how-to videos and I publish them at least three times a week so if you like this channel please subscribe and leave a comment and keep watching so in this video I want to show you how to safely reply to YouTube comments without kind of screwing up your count of videos so what I mean is um, when you go to your video and preview it on YouTube, you're like confusing the YouTube uh, algorithm or like system or whatever it is. And it's counting you watching it. Or if you watch it on a, a different computer, it's counting you watch that on a different computer, you know? So it's not like a legitimate view. So I want to show you how to check your comments without having to have the video play and then make a comment below. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to go to YouTube studio, how to find your comments in the back and how to reply to those comments. So like write a little reply to whatever people say, block people, erase or hide comments and like, you know, leave a heart or a thumbs up. So keep watching. Okay, so I'm just going to go on to YouTube studio. This is my dashboard right now. And then I'm going to scroll down to comments. So I just want to show you where your comment section is. And these are some recent comments on some of my videos. So these are the published comments that you have under your videos. So if you want to respond to people, you should really be responding to them in here. Um, like I said before in the beginning of this video, if you actually go to the video and play it, it's like going to play and record a view of your video. So you don't want it to record a viewer to get like mixed up or anything. You want all your views from other people to count. So you go into the studio and that's where you reply or you can give a thumbs up, a thumbs down. You could give it a heart to like, you know, uh, get it recognized or whatever on the page. So, so I replied and I said, you know, you can buy this so and so here um, on that last comment. So if you scroll over to here, you click on filter then you can search for certain people like your people who are like your frequent commenters or you can search or like refine the filter for your comments to like oh only subscribers or you know um make sure you can only see public subscribers or, or things like that now, if you click on held for a review, right now mine's empty because the last one that I had in there was over 60 days. So after 60 days, it, it gets rid of all of the ones that um, were in yours that are held for review. But for example, if someone's swearing or if they think it's spam or something like that, then it'll be held for review and that's just waiting for you to click OK approved or not approved and delete it or whatever. So in here you can hide comments you can delete people, just press on like the little three dots and it tells you, you know, remove, report, hide, you know, always approve people like this. But I like to have my comments like this so you can approve what kind of comments get in and what don't. Usually I automatically see if somebody makes a comment on my video and I can hide it or, you know, leave it up or give them a heart or whatever. I think it's really good to apply to every single comment that you get and just keep on top of all the comments on your page. So this video has been about how to reply and view comments on YouTube through YouTube Studio. So if you like this video, please subscribe and like or leave a comment and I'll see you on the next one.